today we're going to be doing a lip balm, which is a wax-like substance that is used for chap lips or cold sores. Okay, so here we weighed out our white petrolatum in a 100 milliliter beaker, and we have our lanolin, our silica gel, and our lactose anhydrous, and our almond oil. So the first thing we're going to do after weighing the white petrolatum is put it on the hot plate and make sure to add all the bases together so we can melt them. Use two spatulas. Okay, now we're going to put the almond oil as well. Make sure to put it right in the middle so it doesn't, so you don't lose any of that on the side of the beaker. So after adding all the proper amount of the bases, we're going to let this heat up and make sure to stir it as it's heating, which won't take too long should be around 55 degrees. All right, in the meantime, while your bases are heating up, we can use the silica gel and the lactose and triturate the two, mixing them evenly to add to the bases later. All right, looks like it's ready. We're gonna add the solids into a weighing boat. I have one right here. Okay. Make sure to get all of the solids into the weighing boat. For this, you can use a spatula to get all, all of it from the mortar. Now that we have all of our solids, we can now add it into the bases. Make sure to add the solid slowly. If you add it too fast, you might have some of the particles still remaining at the end. So I'm hitting the weighing boat with the stirring rod just to get some of it into the 100 milliliter beaker. Just keep doing this gradually and keep stirring at the same time. I'm tapping the weighing boat just to let the particles fall into the bases slowly. And keep stirring at the same time. Done. And there we go. Now we are ready to pour it into our topical applicator. But before we do so, remove the 100 milliliter beaker, place it on the bench, let it cool until you're able to hold it in your hand. Turn the base of the topical applicator twice. This is to allow the substance to move up and down when using. After the mixture has cooled, you can now add it into the base applicator. Make sure to overfill the topical applicator because when it cools it tends to shrink. There you go. Just one more here. And this is the desired outcome for the lip balm. Able to move up and down. 
and this is how you make a lip balm.